Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to my channel. Thanks for watching my videos as per usual. Today I thought I would talk about something that's been bothering me a little bit. And I know that you guys really appreciate when I'm honest and when I tell you when I eat junk and when I don't work out and so on and so forth. And I don't know how to be any other way. Um, it's just this is the good and the bad and the ugly of trying to lose weight and I feel like it'd be super fake to lie to you guys about that kind of stuff. A lot of you guys sort of like I don't want to say praise me but I don't know are like thank you for being real like you're so real and I appreciate that and like I follow all these other people and it's just like rainbows and ponies and you're like gritty and we really appreciate that and I appreciate hearing that from you. Um, what I don't sort of get is uh, lately I've been asked a lot of questions either via DM or comments or whatever and people seem really unsatisfied with my answers. For example, uh, someone recently asked me like why I decided to start, what low point did I hit or like what experience that I have that made me decide I wanted to lose weight and I've said it once I've said it a million times I was bored I moved home with my parents and I had nothing to do so I told the person that I was like I was bored uh -huh. like you know what do you want me to say and they were like well that's not motivating but okay <laughs> okay uh I'm not here to motivate you uh this is all for me and anything anybody else takes from it is like a super bonus. But this is just my experience and how I view things. And if you find motivation in that, that's awesome. But it's not my fucking job to motivate you. Yes, it would have been some fucking great Oprah Lifetime movie story for me to be like, oh, I was so sad and I broke a chair and a flight attendant kicked me off because they thought I weighed too much and the plane was going to go down or something. Yes, that would be motivating because it's like, oh, your life is fucking terrible and now you want to lose weight. But that is not how it happened for me. And I'm not going to lie about it. So it's kind of fucked up when it's like, oh, we appreciate you being so real, blah, blah, blah. But then when I'm fucking honest about something, it's like, oh, well, that's not that great. Or, like, we expected something, like, better than that. It's like, okay, well, there's nine million people who have hit that spot, who have broken a chair, who have cried, who've lost relationships, who, like, bad shit has happened, and they decided to lose weight. Go fucking follow them. I don't care. But this is just how shit happened for me. I greatly appreciate every single person that watches the video, takes something from it. I get so much inspiration and motivation from you guys, whether you know it or not. Like, I read every single comment. I try to respond to as many people as I can. Um, and it's it's completely, like, goes both ways for me. Like, I didn't know that when I, when I started an Instagram account... It was going to, I have almost 50,000 followers right now, and I had no clue that it would turn into that. I had no clue gym selfies and pictures of lean cuisine seemed remotely interesting to anyone. It was fucking not even interesting to me. I do feel pressure. I put pressure on myself, I feel like, to perform. Um, like when I post my weigh-ins every week and it's not going down, like I feel pressure, like I have to do better because I have to do better for you guys. Um, but that's all shit I'm putting on myself. That's not anything that, you know, like it's just like I want to I wanna keep doing well, you know, for me mostly because I want to keep losing weight. But, you know, I feel like with so many people kind of watching what I'm doing that I have to produce results and to kind of be told that my story is like not motivating enough or like it could be better is such fucking nonsense because that's not real life. I mean I just want to make a quick video to be like you know sometimes being real isn't as fucking cool as you think it is and it's not you know it's just the nature of the beast and that's that so I'm not that cool. I think we all know this by now, right? 
Uh, if you have any questions, leave it in the comments. Or if you actually, you know what? If there are YouTubers or Instagrammers or something that you really fucking believe in, like you think are real awesome people, link me to their stuff down below. Um, cause I'm looking to follow some more people. Um, and if there's people that you think I should 400% stay away from because they're just trying to sell me mascara or tea, let me know those too, because I want to make sure I don't get steered incorrectly. And I will see you guys later. Bye!